In this video, we discuss the working of single ramp A to D converter. We are going to classify the ADCs as a single ramp ADC counter type A to D converter, successive approximation A to D converter, flash A to D converter and dual slope A to D converter. In this video, we are going to discuss only one single ramp ADC and remaining ADCs are made as a separate videos. This is a block diagram for single ramp A to D converter. Now let us consider, I have given the input as a 4 volt. Now I am supposed to get uh, output as 1 double zero. How this 4 volt is converted into 1 double zero we are going to discuss in this video. Initially reset to the RAM so that RAM voltage will be zero and counter is equal to zero. For the comparator we are given the two inputs. One is a VI input voltage and there is a ramp voltage V. When ramp voltage is less than VI, the output of comparator will be high. And whenever the comparator output is high, the this enables the AND gate and clock reaches the counter, counter starts counting. As the ramp voltage exceeds input VI, then the comparator output V0 will become low. When output becomes low, clock will not reach the counter, counter stops counting. And the control logic will send a enable signal to the latches so that the counter output can be latched. Then the clear or reset signal will be sent to the counter. If a clock frequency change, is it going to affect the counter output? Pause for a minute and think. If a clock frequency increases, no doubt the time required for the ramp generator to reach a 4 volt will remain same. If you increase the clock, automatically the counter output will also increases. Count will increase. Hence, usually clock is chosen after a proper calibration. Drawbacks, it is a less resolution. Ramp generation is affected by the temperature. And again a summary. Increasing the ramp generator voltage and parallel counter is counting. After some time, when the voltage V becomes more than 4 volt, output of the comparator becomes low and clock will not reach the counter, counter stops counting and that control logic will send a enable signal to the large, then it will send a reset or clear signal to the counter. Thank you for watching this video.